Welcome back to NR Element. I'm Mike Gideon, Customer Technical Service Manager at Materion, and today I will be discussing how to properly clean beryllium copper parts. First, all copper beryllium alloys are between 97 and 98 percent copper, so they will tarnish an air and form an oxide or patina like any pure copper or for that matter any other high copper alloy would. Now this film will be a mixture of various copper oxides and beryllium oxide. Remember that beryllium has an exceptionally strong affinity for oxygen, so beryllium oxide will form preferentially, especially at high temperatures. Unlike copper oxide, beryllium oxide is invisible, so you may not even know it's on the surface. And furthermore, beryllium oxide is a very hard, abrasive ceramic material, and it's going to interfere with any plating, soldering, or brazing operations you might be doing afterwards, and it must be removed prior to those operations. Beryllium oxide is also an electrical insulator, so it's going to interfere with the operation of electrical electronic connectors. Now, the good news is that most oxides can be removed by immersion in an acid pickling bath after degreasing the parts. So typically a mixture of sulfuric acid and hydrogen peroxide is preferred, but nitric acid alone or a mixture of phosphoric, nitric, and acetic acids is also proven to work. For very thick beryllium oxide films associated with solution annealing processes, Pre-treatment in a bath of hot caustic sodium hydroxide will loosen the film and permit its removal by the acid pickling bath. However, this is rarely necessary for most customer processing. Remember that the elevated temperatures, higher humidity, and condensation promote the growth of these oxides, so it's best to avoid these situations whenever possible. So thank you for listening, and please feel free to reach out to me or any of my team members with any questions, and we'll see you next time.